How I really hate Mr. Hinkle, he is such an obnoxious person, his voice, how old he is, and more. It didn't seem like calling him by his first name nor grandpa did anything to him, even though his house got destroyed twice. I need a way for his house to get destroyed for good, well, I mean, that flying saucer sized human being flew into that tree and the tree fell onto his house, I need a way to summon her to the scene, gotta think now, what does she like the most? Where's her favorite place to go? That's it. I've got it. She loves to go to McDonald's. I am going to turn Mr. Hinkle's house into McDonald's. That way, that flying saucer-sized human being will destroy his house. Let's do this. Ha 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 ha. To Mr. Hinkle's house we go. Well here we go. All I need to do is put a few McDonald's signs up on his property. Ha 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 ha. McDonald's is here. Now I am going to hide somewhere to watch this all go down. Hey you guys. This must be the new McDonald's that just opened up in our area. Let's grab something to eat. I'm hungry. Wait a second. That's a bit odd. Usually any McDonald's that isn't inside of a mall and on its own property has a drive through Strange. I guess we have to ring the bell to get served. I'll ring it first, then we can each order one by one. Um, hello, who's there? Wait, my gosh, what are you four doing here? And how can I help you guys? Um, sir. It says that your house is a McDonald's restaurant, therefore, we are all here to get something to eat. Well, I hate to break it to you guys, but this is a house, not a McDonald's restaurant. I have lived on this property all my life, and never once has it been a McDonald's restaurant. Wait, guys, there's something coming fast from the distance. I think we'd better run or we might all get killed. Oh, you've got to be fucking kidding me, not again. Yeah. Ah. McDonald's, 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 McDonald's. Come here to me, baby. You are mine now. Oh my god. What on earth was that thing? And why did it eat your entire house? Well, this has happened to me two other times before. I don't know what the fuck it's supposed to be, but it seems like every time it strikes, my sense tells me that K.I. is here. Wow, I am so sorry to hear that, Mr. Hinkle. I would guess we best be on our way now, hope you can get your house rebuilt somehow. Thank you guys, see you for later. Wait a second, who's there? K.I. I swear to god if it's you, come out right now. I know it was you that did this to me and my house. Okay fine, you caught me, Mr. Hinkle, and yes, I was the one that did this to you and your house. Oh my god K.I.U, you never stop do you, that's it, I am so done with your stupid bullshit, I am calling your parents right now, now lay or I will beat you to death. Oh my freaking god Kalu, what the hell is wrong with you? Do you really hate Mr. Hinkle that much? Yes. Yes I do, Mr. Hinkle is an old, smelly, and obnoxious man who can go die for all I care. That is so fucking it Kalu, you are grounded 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 for two years, and as a punishment, since Mr. Hinkle has nowhere to live, he will be staying with us. And he will get to have your room to sleep in and stay in, therefore you will get to sleep in the living room on a couch every night. Oh. That must be him now, come in, Mr. Hinkle. Hey guys, thank you so much for inviting me to live here. No problem, Mr. Hinkle. You may have Kalu's room to stay in since he was the one that got your house destroyed. Find your way up there when you can. As for me and Doris, we will be in the kitchen getting ready for dinner. <laughs> 